Okay, uh, Mr. Rose, so why did you choose to start leading these journalism trips um, for students, and how have you um, come to appreciate that role as a leader, and how has that benefited you? All of it. Well, originally, um, uh, Dean Norton asked me to do it, but the reason I said yes was because I saw it as an opportunity to give students something that I saw too many students lacking when they got out into the real world and started to get a job in professional journalism. Uh, they had not uh, written enough. They had not written enough on deadline, and more importantly, they had not really done any work, uh, many of them had not really done any work for a newspaper on deadline. So uh, the idea developed of getting uh, local newspapers to assign us stories and we'd take our students uh, on a weekend and do them. Um, as far as leadership, um, you know, I, I consider it a collaboration. And that's what I've tried to do with the students. I, I tell them the way it should be done, uh, and then I try to help them do it. Uh, but the work has got to be theirs. Uh, if, if, you, if you challenge students, if you show them the right way to do it, and then if you, if you throw them out there and tell them, now do it, but I'm here as a net you know, if you need if you need some help. Uh, I think they respond, and they respond very well. So you like being a leader so you can challenge other people to, to better themselves? I do. That's, that's, that's a good way to put it. Uh, a, a, leader, a leader's got to challenge people, um, and, and I enjoy challenging people. But a leader also has to be able to get his hands dirty and help them. Uh, you know, sometimes students get out on an interview and they wander in their attention if, they, if they're doing it for the first time. And you might have to uh, help redirect the interview. Uh, you don't want to take over and do their work for them, but you want to give them just enough support so that, uh, so that they can realize what they need to do and then go ahead and do it themselves. Awesome, thank you. Okay.